Hey guys, I have no makeup on. My hair is in a messy bun. It has rained all day long today. Today was homecoming for Trevor. Next weekend is homecoming for Aubrey, so that's why I have like crazy eyeshadow on. But Aubrey and I dropped Trevor off and then we headed to Dollar Tree. Well, that's a lie. We headed to three different Dollar Trees to get, um, to see what they have. I am a, um, teacher's assistant and so I was grabbing things for our classroom because I handle a lot of the crafts um well I handle all of the crafts and so it's easier for me to go and grab the stuff and then my teacher pays me back and we work it out with the school because we also get kind of like a little bit of a budget through the school but obviously our budget goes a lot further if we go to Dollar Tree versus other places. So today I'm going to show you my Dollar Tree Christmas haul. I went to three to four different Dollar Trees. I will not be going to any more Dollar Trees. So first things first, I have six packages of these. Um, these are going to be our gifts that we make for our parents and we're going to have the kids put their fingerprints all on it and draw a black line and it's going to be lights and then we're going to put some pom-pom balls inside and that is going to be our Christmas present to the parents. Um, I grabbed two packages of these small gift boxes and three is in each and then I grabbed two of the bigger ones for gift wrapping and things like that. Um, I grabbed a few ornaments for just home. So I saw this one and I thought it was pretty. So Aubrey is doing a, like a beachy theme for her Christmas tree in her room. So I thought this one would kind of go pretty because it was pearls and I don't know, I just liked it. I grabbed a few stocking stuffers. I grabbed this for my best friend's husband and I grabbed this for my best friend. I send them a package and for a dollar for Dove and a dollar for um, Old Spice Deadlock like hair gel. thought it was really, really good. And honestly, you could take it out of this package and put it in three different stockings and it'd probably be a really, really good stocking stuffer. We are making um, shirts for our kids and we're doing a thumbprint candy cane. And we're gonna put a bow on it and so I grabbed these and I will um, probably fabric glue them on but I thought that they were really pretty and there's 12 and as of right now we have 11 kids in our class so hopefully it'll stay that way and I don't have to go and find more um, but my daughter grabbed a ton of nail polish uh, so we are going to put up stockings in our room and ask for every child to send 10 little things in um, on their day and we're going to fill the stocking over the time of school and then they'll get to bring that home and we're also going to have a Christmas tree in our room and we're going to have a coloring book and crayon gift exchange so I figured grab a few extra coloring books in case the kids don't bring one forget whatever so every kid gets a coloring book so they have these ones um, for a dollar and um just a giant coloring book and you you know you can't beat that price so i grabbed those alongside of that i grabbed and i think i probably could have gotten these cheaper elsewhere but i just went ahead and grabbed them um 16 counts of crayons had i known i would have grabbed more during back to school if i remember we were going to do this but uh these were a dollar for 16 so i grabbed four of them i believe and again, if we don't need them this year, then awesome. We'll save them for next year. Um, I grabbed a uh, stocking stuffer for Ellie. Ellie loves this guy on YouTube. And so I got her some chopstick. Is that that Ryan's crap? I just grabbed these for me. I like these makeup wipes. I don't use these on my face, but like I put my foundation here or like I'll clean my counter every day and I use these. I also grabbed this um, lips um, macaroon lip balm LA colors for Ellie for her stocking. Um, I just thought it was really cute. 
so we are going to do like a ton of crafts so i've grabbed a ton of stickers to put on all the little foamy things that i bought so i have some clear uh snowflakes some green jewels some red jewels um, another like silver snowflake blue snowflakes another red jewel and I'll just put these in our bin and let them um, go through them when they're working on crafts we are also giving all of our babies a Halloween gift bag um, so I grabbed two packages of these I believe yeah two packages of these little like bouncy things um, three packages of these whack I think it's a whack a balloon whack a pack yeah and it like pops up um, and then another blue snowflake um, and you know I'll be reimbursed for all this stuff so it's like it's not it doesn't pain me to buy it because I know that I'll get all the money back um, so I grabbed this for my personal tree. I thought it was cute for a dollar. And I think I'm going to be incorporating a lot of this plaid into my house this year. And then another green <laughs> sticker thing. Like even if you're just, you know, a mom of young kids or a homeschool mom, all these craft things are really just, you know, it's pretty affordable to get them. Uh, we grabbed this one for Aubrey's tree because we figured it could look like a sand snowman. Um, and then I am doing an elf, like Buddy the Elf theme on our door. So I grabbed a few snowflakes to put on the other side of our door, on our door. Um, and I think it's going to be really, really cute. And then, so all the kids really, like last year, I didn't even decorate their rooms. And they were, it was just something that I've never done in all my life. So they were really kind of bummed about it. Um, so I said, okay, I'll definitely decorate their rooms. So... Um, Aubrey picked this sign for outside of her door. I thought it was really, really pretty. And I mean, like, that's a really good sign for Dollar Tree, I think. I mean, like, you can see, like, some of the hot glue and stuff like that. But I was like, that's pretty good for a Dollar Tree sign. And then I grabbed this one for my room. Happy Holly, Holly Days. And I grabbed this one for Trevor's room. It says, oh dear, Christmas is here. And I grabbed this one for Casey and Ellie's room. It says, the elf made me do it. I thought that was really, really cute. Um, I grabbed two sets of lights for our door. They're the little snowflake lights and they're battery operated. And I figure we can turn them on every morning. Just something, you know cute to go sorry I'm trying whenever I do this I'm trying to organize it so I can have certain bags for certain things um I grabbed this that has 18 stickers Halloween stickers these are the bags we're gonna put everything in and then I grabbed two packs of notepads for them to just color or draw in um and that's I think that's everything I got for the Halloween and then we'll throw a couple pieces of candy in Grabbed two nail polish colors for Ellie for her stocking, just some glittery ones because my girls love painting their nails and love having glitter. Um, I grabbed a few more signs. This one I want to put outside on my porch. It's just really, really pretty. And it says, Jingle Bells, White Christmas, Ho Ho Ho, Hang Stockings, Oh Holy Night, Trim the Tree, and Joy to the World. And then I grabbed this one as well that says, Ho Ho Ho. Um, I may put this like on our bathroom or something like that, or we have an area up here that we decorate as well. Um, I grabbed a few more ornaments. I grabbed this one. I thought it was really, really cute. And I figure um, I'll either put it on my tree that I'm doing that's kind of like the buffalo plaid, you know, that type of thing. Or I will put this on um, a present that I give to somebody. I grabbed this tree for Aubrey's room as well for her Christmas tree. It's that pearl. Um, I grabbed a pen for me and my teacher for our desk that have jingles. And then I 
grab these little snowflakes. I thought they were really, really cute. And they're glittery. And I grabbed this Ho 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 Santa. He was cute. And then my best friend, it's a joke that she is like all about chapsticks. And she has like her card chapstick and her purse chapstick and her this chapstick and her that chapstick. So I got her a Carmex. I got her a Mentos mint lip balm. A Carmex, Carmex tub. A Vaseline. I got a Vaseline for me. And then a Carmex classic <laughs> as part of her present because I thought it was just fitting and funny. Um, then my last bag looks to be more crafts. So I grabbed snowflakes and this has 12 of them in it for, um, I don't know if we will do them for now or, um, when we come back and do it more winter, but I went ahead and grabbed those. I grabbed all kinds of pom poms for, either decorating our gingerbread men or if we decide to put these ones in the ornament balls. I grabbed two sets of penguins. Again, that'll probably be one that I save for um, when we come back from Christmas break. Two sets of Christmas trees. And two different color glittery pipe cleaners because if you work in education you know all about it um, and that is everything that I grabbed from Dollar Tree I think I had a few Dollar Tree things that I had in like my haul that I did for organized Christmas I'm not sure um, but yeah I you know I'm not a huge Dollar Tree person I honestly get a lot of things from them for like the kids like and crafting and things like that but it's not a huge place I get decor but you know I was pretty impressed with the signs I don't think that these ornaments will last forever but I think that they're a decent enough decent enough quality for what you pay to get you know a little bit of time from them but yeah that is my Dollar Tree haul